Del Kwan and Tonya Kwiatkowski yet to come. That kind of uh, tells us where the importance of this championship will be. And here is Amber Corwin in fifth place after the short program. Her fourth trip to the Senior Nationals. And she finished in fifth place a year ago in Nashville. And Amber is the only other woman in this competition doing a triple-triple combination. And it's the first thing, a triple-toe, triple-toe, right here. Beautifully done. She skates very relaxed. Triple flip jump. That really was almost a Lutz, if you noticed, a Lutz on the other foot because she curved to an outside edge and didn't even bother going straight. She pushed it over the edge. That made it very hard. And her free leg in the air, I think, may have caused the problems too, was very wide swinging. Single axle, not a double. having a few problems, but we're getting an idea already of how deep the American figure skating is in terms of the ladies. When you look at the rest of the world, there's no one who can match that depth. And of course, you're looking at sending the last two world champions to the Olympics this year. Double toe combination. Oh. oh. She didn't go into that with a real attack. You can never in skating have the opportunity to change your mind or not go full force. Anytime you do that, you're courting disaster. just so crossed that she could not pull them out, and I don't think there was enough height there in the jump to complete the revolution in the first place. It looks like she was going in slow motion with her technique, almost. She's glad to have that over with. <laughs> yes, yes. It can be very, you know, you can get out into a situation like this, not get your breath, and become so tired that you can almost find it impossible to complete the program. A little moral support from another world champion and another national champion. Todd Eldridge talking to Tara Lipinski. She can relax and watch like the rest of us now. <laughs> And a reminder, this is how the Olympic team will be selected. The national champion goes automatically. The next two spots chosen by the International Committee and based on the national results the last two years and the world championships, they take all of that into account how you have finished at your competitions. And you can see these marks really 
far lower than the other skaters. She just did not complete the jumps that would give her any kind of standing in this competition. There's Angela Nikodinov in sixth place after the short program. A year ago, she was a surprise fourth place finisher in Nashville. 5.0. That's Scott Wenlin, Amber's coach, former pairs partner, five Jenny Mino. Quite a variation five there from 5.0 five five to 5.4. Five so Amber now in third place in terms of those that have skated. Right behind Nicole Bolbeck, who is in second. Of course, Tara Lipinski, the current leader. But Michelle Kwan and Tanya Kwiatkowski still to skate.